Well, Scott Boris and his team have been very busy at the 2019 winter meetings. The notable signings just over the last few days. It started with Steven Strasburg, moved on to Garrett Cole, and then Anthony Rendon. We mentioned it earlier, $814 million combined. It's amazing to think, Meredith, that he also has Dallas Keuchel, Hyunjin Ryu, Nicholas Castellanos, that when it's all said and done after these winter meetings, he'll probably have negotiated over a billion dollars worth of contracts. I would love to see that Boris company Christmas party. There's got to be a lot of celebrating going on right there. But you know what? You look at those, you expected the Yankees would make a play for Garrett Cole. It obviously worked out in their favor. After winning the World Series, I don't think it's much of a surprise that Strasburg is back with the Nationals. The money, I think that really set the stage for everything the 7245 that maybe is a little higher than people anticipated coming into the meetings but I look at the Rondon move and I think yes it's nice that the Angels are going and trying to put pieces around Mike Trout one of the best players in Major League Baseball but they still need pitching they need an awful lot of pitching to compete while that move makes them better I still think they're a ways away from being the team that they need to be yeah, they lost 92 games last year the most they've lost in 20 years Meredith is exactly right you've got to go out and get one maybe two pitchers but Scott Boris is very detail oriented so I have to throw this in there we forgot about Moustakas he signed Moustakas right. before the meetings so that takes that number up closer to 900 million do do five percent on a billion by the way <laughs> I think it's 50 million dollars so Meredith is exactly right this has been a banner year for them and there is more to come with those players you mentioned I think the question is how long does the Christmas party last yeah. it might be like a week yeah, but that 5%, it could go on a couple of weeks, I think. But uh, I think about these winter meetings in general. I mean, there's been so much activity, a lot more than the last couple of years. And with Strasburg, Meredith is right, setting kind of that market. Um, you know, the winter meetings, over $908-plus million, 11 contracts this offseason. Uh, it's been a lot of activity. But I think about the American League West, and we saw our buddy Billy Epler, the GM of the Angels, and congratulated him on the Rendon deal. And he was quick to say what you guys have just mentioned. Uh, I got some more work to do I got to go get some pitching and we'll see if we can kind of get back in this the Houston Astros have taken a step back obviously for what's going on off the field but when you lose Garrett Cole now all of a sudden they don't seem like they're a, a shoe in to win that division and by the way the Angels also got Anthony Rendon and Texas didn't and the Rangers wanted to get him right at Joe Madden they have a new manager you mentioned Epler he's in his last year as general manager this is the time for them to pounce in that division and that's why I'm not even sure that one pitcher is enough go and get a couple of those guys Ryu and Keichel are both ground ball pitchers you've got Rendon and Simmons on the left side of the infield that's the best defensive left side of the infield in baseball not even close Th those two guys are unbelievable so perhaps this is their chance to finally do something and step forward but you